What the hell? Oh, hey, what's up, everybody? My name is TrophyNet, the babbling Belgian, and welcome back to Mass Effect Andromeda. The gravity well is a way to get you back on the surface without you needing to do that entire uh, jumping puzzle. The only annoying thing is that I, well, my nomad is still over there, so I need to run back. But yeah, uh, we were looking for those remnant tech pieces that PB needs for her scanner. And uh, yeah, the next one is on Havarl, so I'm gonna head the right over there to the jungle planet of Havarl. And uh, yeah, see you guys there. Ryder, Lexi was looking for you. And while we're on the Tempest, um, both Kahlo and uh, Suvi have been uh, busting my balls about the fact that Lexi wants to have a word with us. So let's do that uh, right now. Let's go down and have a little chat with our uh, resident medic. Because she seems to have something on her mind over here on the left, if I'm not mistaken. Okay. The door is broken. Move your arm again. Readings won't change, Doc. Your prosthetics are sinking properly. Your neuropathy-induced pain levels are consistent. Hey, I'm used to it. It's okay. No, it's not okay. You keep fighting smart, you hear me? Oh. You don't have much left in terms of organ redundancies. <clears throat> Is he okay? No, it's fine. I don't mind. Everything okay? This looks like... a lot. It is a lot. Just nothing he didn't already know about. What do you mean? He's fine, just... old. And missing too many parts. And too stubborn for his own good. You, you like Drac, Lexi? You just the way I am, Doc. Interesting. Hmm. Don't get off that table until the scan is done. Can I ask what happened? Arm, side, hip, part of my leg. Strain balancing threading across my spine. It's all prosthetics and implants. That's a lot. Made it through the Krogan rebellions. Watch my culture disintegrate. Survived centuries as a merc, and all sorts of pirate shenanigans. A thousand years of combat experience, all it took was one idiot with a pack of frag grenades. But you made it. But you're here, still standing. You survived. Yeah, but surviving ain't always living. I hit some dark moments. Implant rejection after implant rejection. Prosthetics not sinking properly. Everything hurt. A lot. All the time. No purpose to anything. How did you deal with it? I didn't. I fell right into that pit. Almost. But then some shaman shows up, drops the tiniest little baby girl in my lap. This one's dying, he said. Not worth the trouble, he says. Useless is what he meant. And then, yeah, you felt like she was the same as you at that point. That's awful. It's practical, Krogan. Gave me a purpose again. Wasn't just about me anymore, so I got help. Learned how to take care of myself, take care of her. And she took care of me. He found a way to live again. We sure did. Wasn't easy on either of us. I'm old, stuck in my ways, and cash... Cash has wanted to change everything since she could talk. Raising Cash taught me an important lesson. And that is? What was it? Took me a while to figure it out, but it's important. Parents aren't meant to be a goal, 
or a finish line. We're the starting line. Where you go from there, it's all you. Remember that. Thank you, Drac. Wow, that was a great scene. Oh yeah, so that was how to act tough. Read email from Cash. Yeah, I didn't read the email. Apparently that uh, that led to this scene. Interesting. And Lexi, did you want to talk to me? Going through the readouts from the Cat facility. I've never seen such advanced genetic technology. Frankly, it's light years ahead of our capabilities. Um, Jesus Christ, what the hell? I thought I talked to her like this already. I ran across another memory fragment. Dad made Sam for Mom to cure her. I knew that was part of it, but... You didn't know it was the driving force. He gave up everything trying to save her. You didn't realize how important his family was to him? I guess not. Maybe that's what he wanted you to see. How is crew morale? How do you think the crew is holding up? I'm happy to share what I can without violating patient confidentiality. Anyone in particular? I sort them in their files and my brain by species. Okay then. Why do you sort them that way? Just easier for me to see patterns in behavior. Okay, what about the non-human crew? Uh, Vetra. Tell me about Vetra. Are you asking me for relationship advice? Bow chicka Maybe. wow wow. Vetra's used to being the caretaker. Show her it's okay to relax and take care of herself now and then. Is PB alright? She's avoiding me. Probably thinks I'll poke her with a needle if she gets too close. To be fair, you're always giving me shots. Not in the hallway. Yeah, that is true. <laughs> Not in the hallway. How's our Solarian? He's quite the gossip. Tight-lipped about himself, though. Huh. Is Drac good? He seemed conflicted since Elodin. Drac likes to think of himself as a fossil. Something from the past to look at and learn from. But you've shown him he has a lot left to live for. Thanks, Ryder. You're welcome. Is Jal doing okay? He's adjusting. The rest of us have at least some understanding of each other's cultures. But to Jal, we're all outsiders. It's a lot to take in. I'd say he's doing pretty well. That he is. Thanks that he insight. is indeed. Um. Hmm. I don't see I'll how she needed it. my. Uh, I'll be here if you need me. My help there. So yeah, just gonna leave again, and we'll uh, head towards Havarl. So we were on Havarl previously, but only for a very short time. And if the previous part is anything to go on. This will probably be a short visit as well. So let's see how far we can get to the objective here. Because Avarl actually has, well, a very small map compared to the other uh, planets we can visit. So um, there's only two major remnant ruins and we need to get to the northern one. Which should be fine, I think, because I cleared it out previously, but might still be an issue, of course gonna try and avoid the wildlife okay fight for what oh shit okay There we go. And there's the last one. I think. Yeah, that was everything. Everything outside at least, because this ruin seems to be rather big. And there's another creature. And a lot more where that came from, probably. Let's go a bit deeper. So this is, I think we... Found an Angaran in this place. Is this where I need to find that piece? Doesn't seem like it. Let's go back outside and move a bit further. Because we never went further inside of this uh, ruin. Okay. That's at least three observers. So we might have to be careful here. Okay. That was 
tense for a few seconds there, but we managed to pull out great with our combination of powers. And now we need to go... What? Do I need to go up all of a sudden? I'm not at the right position, am I? God damn it. Yeah, I'm going to have to loop around, so see you guys in a second. Okay, see, we have more row car. There we go. A Rokar sharpshooter going down. Where is he going? Boom! Is that his head? Boom! Yeah, we're not going to see him again. There we go. Now we're certainly not going to see him again. Because he flew far. Okay, let's reload that fully. Something close by. Sounds like gunfire. Oh shit. There's a lot of things that just woke up, I think. What the hell is all that? I don't see anything at the moment, but they're all up here. Get behind the tree! Whew. So Rokar and Remnant, and apparently they're all shooting at us. Oh no! Oh that... Seriously? That just one hit killed me. A real core. What the hell is that? Oh! The remnant are mad. There we go. Oh shit! Hide! What the hell? Okay, that thing is dead. There we go. I think that killed everything. What the hell was this thing? I think it completely vanished. An undocumented mineral has been detected, Pathfinder. Okay. Where is it? Bioluminescent fungi. I kind of have the feeling that that was not it. That's something as well, just giving me some research data. What else is there? Because I, I kind of hate this planet. Because it's really unclear how to get from one area to the other. It's kind of a maze. Can I get ammo? I think I did. Okay. So I have sniper rifle bullets. Which is good. And now how do I get that? Because I'm not going to jump into the electric pool again. Ow! Jesus. Christ. You rock. 
I know. That was fun. It was. You guys have a very different meaning of fun than I have. Is there a way to go down? Yeah, there is. Oh, gold. This doesn't look good. A gravity well. Obviously. The item isn't just laying here. No, we need to go down. Great, here we go. Express elevator going down. Remnant abyss. Wait, what? Now the game says the item is up there. Well, uh, no it isn't, so the, the staircase upstairs is obviously up there, but the item is further in. So, let's see how big this place is. I'm hoping for a little vault. The item is already showing a marker closer by. Is this opening up anything else? Looks like it is. wall great so now there's a shield in our way okay that was a lot all of a sudden there's a lot of noise going around here nope that was not what I wanted to do remains let me check the remains There's still gunfire over there. Can't really see what that is. Remnant console. I dropped down into the floor, obviously. It's got a bit of health over here. What's this? There's another door over here as well. Might be able to loop around, possibly. There's a lot of enemies on the map. There we go. Seems like the laser beam is still here, but... Yeah, this, this game is kind of buggy like that. Anything else? Don't want to run too far ahead. Oh, that music doesn't bode well. More enemies incoming. Hello? This is a big empty area by the way. This could go every way, so... Piece of Remtech I need is still here. Get down. Thank you. There's the turrets. Oh, and the Star Wars reference. One in a million kids. Woo. Oh shit, there's assemblers all over the gap. Come on, destroyer. Get destroyed. This thing did, is this thing dying? Slowly. Yeah, there it goes. I'm out of ammo. Ah, and Drakus. 
Is Drac standing upright or does he need a revive? I think he's upright. There we go. So another uh, destroyer destroyed and of course a lot of dead Rokar because they didn't manage to kill this thing. Is there any ammo around here? Because I would love some ammo. Ammo? Anyone? No? Oh, over there. There we go. Ammo. Let's head even deeper into the ruins because that seems like a good idea. Oh, data pad. Ha! We're in! Found the broken access point into this remnant structure. We're gonna get the piece the bosses are after and I'm gonna win that bat after all. From Butch. This must have been Butch. Butch is a very dead Krogan. Well, that was a clusterfuck. Who the hell is Riley? They're all dead. And now you're here, I'm screwed. Um... Yep. Or don't worry. He'll be okay. Oh, really? We were supposed to clean out this site before you got here, but there were too many damn bots. This outfit doesn't care a lick about any of us. So, uh, that's what you get, but who are they? Tell me about them. Just joined, so I can't tell you much. The Krogan's name is Crank or Crankit or something. He runs the field crews. That's all I know. Here, take the choice piece from this site. I'm officially retired. You this are? Is the second piece you need, PB. Yep. And the last one's turned up on Kadara. Coordinates uploaded. Ooh. Go to the Remnant Ruins on Kadara. There we go. So I'm just going to check out this container as well. Not that there's anything of interest in there, but... There we go. And the last piece is set to be on Kadara. So let's head over there and clear out the last... Um, well, Remnant site that we need to get a piece from. See you guys over there in a second. I like what you said about life and longevity, Drac. Remind me what I said? You said the number of years we're around isn't what matters. Back home, I knew so many old Asari who stopped learning, asking questions. Sounds less like living than waiting to die. Exactly. I wouldn't trade one of my years for a hundred of theirs. What a well if it isn't our competition! Okay, so we're on the Kadara like and the Remnant Ruins. And there's a lot of uh, dudes down here. Ready to shoot our face, apparently. But uh, I have a sniper rifle and a very nice vantage point. So let's get these guys out of hey, here, shall we? Looking for these ruins? There we go. I think that's pretty much the last one of them. Probably gonna right. have to Let's find. find a piece of tech PB needs. Yeah, indeed. There's a corpse here. Outlaw, outlaw anarchist. Checking this container. Settlement uh. core relay. Ah, there we go. Remnant relic. That was rather easy. Meet PB and Kadara port to acquire rem tech piece from outlaw Empty. Krogan. There's a data pad. Looks like there's a message for us. <laughs> Hope my boys put up a fight. But you're too slow, Pathfinder. I got what you're looking for. I'll meet you and your Asari at Kadara Port. You can buy the tech from me. Out. We need that piece, Ryder. Guess we've got a date with an annoying outlaw who fancies himself a rival. Okay then. So back on Kadara Port, I think this is the way. Yeah, there we go. So there's PB. And now we need to meet this Krogan, Kranit. <laughs> Charming. Waiting for that Krogan to show? Just need to buy the Remtech piece off him so I can perfect my remnant scanner. He and his crew keep showing up at sites we're targeting. It can't be coincidence. I think they could be following us somehow. That kind of adds it up. Makes sense. It would be nice to know for sure. I'm working on it. Ryder, come in. We've got a problem. Go ahead, Callow. We've had an intruder. Got on board and into PB's quarters. Her bot is gone. Pock? Yeah, proof of concept is gone. Uh, anything else missing? Any other areas compromised? We're doing a full recon, but I don't think so. They left an impressive piece of rem tech and a recorded message, relaying it now. Ryder, it's Kalinda Terev. Pelisari is, well, whatever she calls me these days. 
Please tell her thank you for the nifty bot. I trust the Remtech piece my crew took will be adequate payment? Oh, and no need to wait for my Krogan friend, Kranit. He and his outlaws work for me. Ta. Oh, Shit. interesting. Why can't she just leave me alone? Seems personal. Why does she have it in for you, PB? She shouldn't. I'm the offended party. Ugh. To complete my scanner, I need access to the storage device in Pock. Kalinda's always been a troublemaker. Anything for a rise, and if there's a profit in it, all the better. I'm sorry you're catching her crap now, Ryder. You don't have to deal with this. I'll take care of it on my own, I promise. No, 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 no. We'll help you. Hey, we're in this together. Uh, thanks. When I have a lead on getting Pock back, I'll let you know. <sighs> Bitch stole my bot. Bitch stole my bolt. So that's, uh, that's a very fitting way to end this episode because I'm going to take a little break. Thank you guys obviously for watching. If you enjoyed the episode, don't forget to like it right here on YouTube. And apparently we need to hold on uh, continuing this quest. So next time we're going to do something else. See you guys next time. Goodbye.